people often ask me what happens in the session and how is my session with me doing core energetics and radical aliveness and a kind of somatic release where the body's involved and how is it different than other kinds of therapies, um, other kinds of practices. Uh, so that question around what do you do? Well, basically, come sit down, be comfortable, maybe stand up, feel what you're feeling in your body, um, talk about this must be kind of an uncomfortable experience, starting to you know, come in with an issue or a place that's really difficult and challenging in your life, and uh, then have to express yourself. And that can create a lot of anxiety. Um, I know it does for me when I started working with new people. And when you start to get vulnerable, it's hard. So those are the things we talk about right away. Um, because it's a relationship. It's a relationship that my client has with me, as well as they start to have a relationship with themselves in a different way. They're going to start hearing themselves saying things, hearing themselves connecting the dots, um, hearing themselves say, oh wow, I feel a lot of anxiety in my gut right now. What's that from? I'm just sitting here with you. And that's where we'd start to explore. Um, when you get that kind of anxiety, oh, it happens all the time. Hmm. Um, the issue you just talked about, do you get those kinds of uh, feelings? Oh, yes, for sure. And then we'll just go a little bit deeper. Um, and what I love is that it's very creative. We'll start one place, maybe with one topic, and all of a sudden we've gone this direction and that direction and back down and, and brought in some information about history and childhood and memories start to come up for people. And I'm like, I'm like there the whole time, like, yes, and totally going into uh, my own personal experiences. Hmm, where do I get an instinct to make a connection to some other um, point that might be helpful just to go deeper and to let this be a fuller experience? And um, that's where it really makes me happy that Often people who have had a lot of talk therapy, so they know a lot about their history and they may know about the trauma and experiences they've had in their life. But you add the body, you add certain kinds of awareness, you add this aspect of their opening up their perspective, and then that's like zing. They make this kind of eureka moment. It's like, I never thought of that. Oh my gosh. No wonder I act that way. And I love that part because it's, it allows them to feel compassionate towards themselves, um, have that kind of self-empathy. And from there, you're not beating yourself up. Why can't I not change? Why can I not change? Well, now you've got some reasons why you might have certain kinds of ways of being, defense systems. Um, uh, reacting in ways, maybe being triggered in ways that you never thought made any sense. And that's something that I can really help people with. Is, I call it connecting the dots backwards.